a little over a year ago, I uploaded the first part of the 1 to 700 with the Devil Fruit Notifier series, the noob to pro. Recently, I completed that series, but a lot of you were like, I never saw part one and two. A lot of you haven't seen the beginning. So today's video is exactly that. I've taken all three videos, I've slapped them together into a marathon style. For those of you who want to watch me do all the leveling from one all the way up to 2400, the max level. Just keep in mind, guys, that the first two videos were before the latest update. So the game's going to look old for a little bit. Then it's going to look new. Regardless, the content is the same. And to celebrate us completing the series, I'm going to give three people in the comment section down below the Devil Fruit Notifier Game Pass. So all you got to do is make sure you're subscribed with notifications turned on. Press like. Leave a comment down below with your username. And of course, the more of this video that you watch, the better chance you will have to win. So thank you all for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Let's get into it because it's a long video. Welcome to the end game. Except I'm a level one. A level one with, as the title has already told you, the Devil Fruit Notifier Game Pass. So here's my plan, guys. I am going to basically use every style possible i'll be using melee i'll be using swords guns and after roughly an hour a fruit is going to spawn and i have to eat every single fruit i come across whether it's a uh, good or bad fruit let's get started i'm gonna kill some bandits quick tackle get messed up and uh, yeah in like an hour when i'm probably past monkeys i should be able to get my first fruit all right no quest one last bandit and there is level 15 i'm gonna skip sword i see no reason to put anything into sword when i'm gonna end up using a fruit anyway so for now melee will do let's head over to the jungle to fight the monkey although gorillas are at level 15 i always wait till 20 to start doing them because I'm using combat, this might even be a terrible idea. I might have to stick to monkeys. It also looks like the king has spawned, which means I could do him after I defeat eight of these guys. Gorillas are dead. Gorilla king time. Hopefully I can defeat this guy. At level 35, I move on to the pirate island. And yeah, dead. Too easy. Level 35, time to move on to the pirate village. So although the requirements are 30 and the brute requirements are 40, I've always done 35 to come over here because when you're not using an AoE fruit or something, these guys are a little bit annoying to fight against. Level 40, time to kill 10 brutes. I think this is where we're going to really start to see combat drop off a little bit. Should have done this earlier, but let's pick up our slingshot so that we can group mobs up and just make our life generally easier. Okay, if you're ever grinding with just combat or anything just against the brutes, I have found this fantastic little trick. Lure them inside the building. Their attacks don't hurt you. You just swing against the wall and you're good to go. All right, we just accepted a quest, but a fruit has been detected. This is the first fruit we're going to get a chance at. It looks like it's definitely in this direction. It's 700 meters away, so I don't think it's in the sky, which is the only place that I... Ooh, hello. No? Okay, the sky is the only place that I don't think I can get it from. All right, this is the way. Hope... Oh, I mean, if it's on this island, I might not be able to climb up. I don't have Gepo yet. All right, we're going to be able to see this fruit pretty much straight away. I'm hoping for a fruit that has a sword, but place your bets in the comment section down below. Let's see if we're lucky. This side, it is. Oh, it's terrible. It's a terrible fruit. It's a dark pink fruit. Look at that. Oh, hooray for us. <laughs> and that is level 60. I've actually realized something amazing. Didn't consider this, but the chopped fruit is like a very free, very low level Logia fruit against any sword user, which made those brutes super easy. Desert bandit time right from level 60, and these guys are exactly the same. They can't hurt me! Oh no, I was ordering lunch, so there's a new fruit already. I don't know if I'm ready to give this fruit up. Oh, I don't know. That's terrible, isn't it? Oh, <laughs> Hooray! It's 
the kilo fruit. Okay, I was having lunch and lucky for me, a new fruit was detected because the kilo fruit is terrible. I have made almost no progress with the kilo fruit, but that is, yeah, I took my time eating lunch. Oh, what's that? Oh, is that the bomb fruit? Okay, I was wrong when I said almost anything was better. No! That's level 75. Moving on to the desert offices, which are a little bit of a pain because of where they are. Level 90. We can finally move on to the ice island quickly by all the abilities. That's Gepo. That's Haki. And I can't quite learn a flash step yet. Bummer. Level 105. Yeti time. This is difficult. A fruit has spawned mid-fight. Okay, save me from this bomb fruit game, please. We're so lucky the fruit's on the ground. The fruit's on the ground. What is it? Is it good? Is that Phoenix? It's Phoenix! Okay, this is better than anything I've had so far. Yes! 130. Time to head over to Marine Ford. The Phoenix is obviously very difficult to mastery, but also very rewarding i didn't get any footage of me doing the admiral but that is fine because we are now doing sky bandits just so i can be on the same server for 60 minutes in order to get a new fruit phoenix is cool but i don't want to grind all the way to 700 with phoenix it would take forever we're also gonna buy a dark step from sanji just in an attempt to speed things up a little bit finally it's new fruit time i really hope that we're gonna get something good oh it's a good fruit it might even be phoenix but it, it, i always yo i've gotten ice and rumble here so many times what fruit is it oh yes a grinding fruit and that's level two. Oh, i didn't quite make it all right i'm like in a smidgen off 200 the chances of us actually finding a fruit while server hopping at prison is pretty low so i am very happy that we'll probably be doing that grind with the rumble fruit 225 no new fruits yet but i have unlocked sky thunder for the rumble fruit now I can move on to the Chief Warden. That means two bosses per server. Faster XP. 250. Moving on to the Swan Boss. And then finally, we can leave Impel down. That is 350. We can move on to the Magma Admiral. Finally, we're really, really close to unlocking Skybeam with uh, the Rumble Fruit. And because we're hopping servers to do bosses, we're not finding fruit. So if we can stay lucky... I will be able to level up a bunch before I run into another fruit. 425, which means we can move on to the fish lord, whatever his name is on here, Horty Jones. There's a fruit, fruit in the game. I've been hopping servers, doing the marine boss, the fish lord, whatever. And finally, we have located a fruit. Hopefully nobody else gets it. Yes, we're in the right spot. What is it? What? Wait, what is that? Oh, please be good. The door fruit. Might as well get Electro while we are here. 500,000. Boom. This is a much better style for grinding. So I got to mastery that one up. And that's level 500. We can move on to Whisper. I am very glad that that boss is over. So I just joined a random server. And I found the falcon fruit. It had nothing to do with the notifier because if the fruit's already spawned, the notifier doesn't work. So I'm a falcon now. <laughs> 575, we are finally moving on to fighting Anel. This could be our probably, this probably will be our last boss unless we get another fruit that is really good for grinding. I don't see any way I could defeat Cyborg. This guy's gonna be hard enough. And right now, at least the falcon fruit can get me over here very, very quickly. 676. Still using the falcon fruit when you're server hopping to find bosses, you do not encounter many fruits. I think I'm going to stay here for a little while and maybe even just go all the way to 700. Falcon fruit works really well when you've got a lot of space. 700. So I actually have a little bit of explaining to do before we start today's video. Wait, is this fruit... On the island here, this might actually be on the island. So I was going to use this account to spend candies for Christmas on fruits and it never happened because you can't do that anymore. Which means I bought it the light fruit 
and I gained it like 28 levels while auto clicking to to get candy and nothing came of that so in order to start part two I had to get a new fruit and it looks like we will be starting today's video grinding with none other than the string fruit. Okay, that's pretty great. I do need some mastery though, game. 37 mastery and one kill. All right, I'm gonna get this ready and then we can do the ice admiral. All right, 54 mastery. Let's find out if we can uh, take down this guy. Obviously, I also have my melee, which is perfectly fine to use. I just have to uh, <laughs> not get absolutely destroyed by this guy's attacks. All right, we got that down pretty easily in the end. Oh, I gained like no mastery. And now I believe I'm allowed to go to the second C. All right, the video begins. Yo, our first fruit in the second C. I really, really hope this is something good. Like something we have mastery on, please. String fruit's not bad, but it's not awakened. So it's also not that great. I'm guessing we're going over here. What is it? Where is, oh, oh no, is that bad? Oh, no. That's not a good start to the video. All right, level 750 it means we can start doing the diamond boss. Unfortunately, with this fruit, it is really hard to get over to the diamond boss. But I'm only going to kill him until 775. So it's not too bad to do like 12 kills. All right, we managed to kill him. And we got three levels. Yes, so that means even less kills. I need stamina and I need HP. So I think I'm going to start with stamina because I'm also using electro or electric, which is amazing additional damage. Finally, a fruit. We might actually have a chance now. Please give me something amazing. All right. We all know it's over in the corner here. Everybody knows this spawn. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, this video is going to take so long to make. I keep getting the worst fruits please give me two levels yes all right 775 this is where things get a little bit easier because you can group up the mobs over here and they're they're kind of easy to defeat i think they're the swan pirates we're also getting closer to the 850 that we need to finally be able to get mink version 2 which is gonna speed everything up a lot. There's level 800. We're gonna try out the factory staff, but these guys have devil fruit, so they're a little bit annoying to grind. This is taking a very long time. You guys are not gonna see this video for quite a bit. It isn't really that the second C is all that difficult. It's just, it's that I have a really, really bad fruit. And so far I have gotten unlucky with fruits. Yo, I just died again trying to do factory staff, but a fruit has spawned, finally. Maybe my salvation. Oh, we have been so lucky that it has been like on the first two islands every single time. Where is it? Is it back over where the last one was? Oh, oh, please tell me that's dark. Yes. Yes, I can definitely use dark. Yo, I wasn't recording, but another fruit, please. I mean, dark is really good. So please. Don't... Oh, <laughs> yes. All right. Everything goes faster. Things are finally starting to speed up now that I'm doing Jeremy nearly at level 900. And then 925 it is for the gravity boss. So I'll probably do Jeremy to 925 or at least close. Then maybe some marine captains. But doing bosses is awesome because I jump servers. So I never really see any fruits. And I get to keep my light fruit for a while, which is seriously speeding this up. All right, we're well over 850. 50 now we might as well start this quest so that we can work on version two thank god you're here this one pirates yeah this gives you good experience when you finish it as well so swan's raid we get a heap of xp all i gotta do is defeat 50 pirates and then we can work on version two of the mink which we need to get around all right just like how the first c starts off incredibly slow it is exactly the same in the second c and now that we're about to move on to the gravity, things should speed up a lot for this account. I am very lucky still so far because I'm server hopping. I haven't run into any fruits, but I'm sure that relatively soon when I start working on mastery, maybe to unlock something like superhuman, I'm going to have to change. And if we get something bad, it is going to slow us down again. And there we go, 926. We can move on to gravity now. Finally, things will move faster. 
I'm also Mink version 2. I finished that quest. Don't know if I told you that in another clip, but Mink version 2 is done, so we are slightly faster and it is less painful to get around. All right, I'm kind of sick of the light fruit, so I'm going to stay on the same server for an hour and I'm just going to kill zombies because also sick of defeating the gravity boss. He's uh, very annoying to fight against. I'm going to do this till, I don't know, whatever level. These guys I have low gear against. So it makes them super easy. I've got to go look at a leveling guide now because I've never, I've only ever done this once. So I gotta figure it out. All right, guys, progress update. I've moved on to the snow troopers because as long as I've got this light fruit, it is just really efficient to sort of kill anything with. So I'm about to hit the low gear point for the other side of the island and then I'll go over there and start killing those guys. And then I don't really know what is next. But I did manage to hit 2,200 in my blocks fruit, so my damage is sort of maxed out now. I should be really, really close to a new fruit spawning, which could completely change the tone of this video. If, uh, if we get a bad fruit, we might have to change our strategy. So there we go. That is 1,080, which means... Uh, this NPC gives you the quest. I have small brain. All right, these guys shouldn't be able to hurt me anymore. Awesome. Oh, no, man. This is it. There's a fruit that has spawned and this could totally ruin our day. This video has already taken longer than I expected, but this could just be a nail in the coffin for us. Anything usable, please. Hopefully something from a previous video like Falcon or let's get light again or I can't remember what else. I think I used Rumble. That would be great. All right, we're under one of the trees here. Oh, what is that? Is that string? Oh, I thought it was light again. No. Okay, smoke it is. I mean, I have never done grinding with smoke on this account, but I have done a little bit with smoke. It's not too bad. Look how little progress I made in an hour because I was stuck with the smoke fruit. Do not underestimate how much a good fruit speeds up your ability to grind. If you have a bad fruit, it is definitely worth investing the time to get a better one. All right, don't think I've ever gotten a fruit on graveyard before, but maybe something good, please. Oh, oh no. Oh no. I don't know if this is good for grinding or not. I've never used it properly, but uh, barrier fruit time, boys. I'm really excited for this to be the last time I have to fight the gravity boss because we are about to finally hit 1,150 and move on to the smoke admiral. There we go. 1,150. We are going straight. Hello? Hello? I'm stuck on something. I'm completely... Oh, there we go. All right. That is 1,250. Now we're moving on to the deckhands on the cursed ship. And I'm really, really hoping that now that we're not server hopping for bosses, we can uh, find ourselves a brand new fruit. Boys, there's a fruit. Please give us something good. I need something that can fight against groups a little bit better. Okay, slowest boat ride ever. It could be on this island, maybe on the other end. Yeah, this is 100% it. Please game, have something good for me. What is that? This smoke fruit i wonder oh is that gonna be better i have a feeling it's not gonna be better but at least it's a low gear fruit we got a fruit we finally got another fruit i'm really enjoying grinding regular mobs so i can change fruits smoke has been great because it's a low gear which is making grinding very easy so if we do get something all right game give me something good please don't give me some trash what is it oh is that smoke again oh <gasps> No, it's sand. I thought it was light. No. Oh, I got so excited. All right, sand fruit it is. We've never mastered it up. That's not awesome. So I got my booster shot today and the lady said that I might experience headaches. <laughs> I get headaches almost every day. So I'm already starting to feel it. But this is my last lot of deckhands. After this, I can finally go over to the ice island where I can do... That seems really loud. Kabo! Oh, that's not all of them. I gotta kill four more. There we go. One, three, five. Oh, we're only going to 1500. We are nearly there. I am very excited to finally finish the second C. Not knowing what to do really slows you down. Now that I have a strategy, I think I would be way faster at this. Also, getting bad fruit slows you down. All right, after quite a bit of time here, I think we are finally about to hit 1,400. We're really close to the level already, so I'm guessing we're going to get two. 
Logia has just kicked in at like 95 or something. So the last few levels have been a breeze. There we go, 1,400, amazing. We might be on the final stretch now. I don't think I can do the Tide Keeper on this account. Not if I have a bad fruit. Like maybe right now with this fruit, I could pull it off, but I'm not expecting much. All right, that was terrifying and only worth two levels. Okay, I need to reapply some points. I need a lot more HP. I came over here to do a quick stat refund because obviously I've generated more than enough candies. But there's also a fruit in the game, so I need to be quick. Yo, I can see it and it looks like a good fruit. That, oh no, don't be green. Oh, why are you green? Not the barrier. Actually, this is probably good for killing bosses. This is going to be great for me. Thank you, barrier. Welcome back. Yo, I just hit 475. Sorry, I wasn't thinking about it and it just sort of happened. I am going to go and try to kill the Tide Keeper. I know it's not the hardest boss, but I've only ever done it with like good fruits. <laughs> so we'll see if I can pull this off using the barrier fruit. And I died. So the barrier fruit can't block any of the sea beast attacks which is a little bit annoying oh but he didn't heal i got back in time okay the only thing i can do to avoid those attacks is get him trapped in the prison because it shields me and it looks like i've actually maybe managed to kill this guy oh the xp yes all right two levels per kill feels good man this should be our final kill the completion of the video that has unfortunately kind of gone a bit derailed because of the old booster that really, really messed me up more than I expected it to. Really hoping this gets me into 1500, boys. And, you know, the second C is definitely a lot more fun to grind through than the first. And that's mostly just because I could stop grinding at any point. And I could have gone and unlocked some hockey colors if I wanted to. There was always that option. Uh, there's, you know... Fruits are supposedly better here. I don't know necessarily if I believe that, but I have heard that the Lox Fruits dealer cousin gives better fruits based on what C you're in now. And then there's like race version one and two. I mean, two and three. I didn't do three, but I probably should have. And there's all these new cool items, like even just getting the Rengoku is really awesome. So it's definitely, this is it. Like get to the second C and the game is more fun. And because of that, I will have a 1 to 700 like detailed guide coming out relatively soon to help you guys get to the second C because that's when the game is just so much more fun. Where did this guy go? Really should have unlocked Observation Hucky on this account. No, 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 no. I got this. There we go. Now I'm coming after you, beastie. I've actually had enough of you guys bullying me. That's what I thought. I currently have the light fruit because I've been using it for different videos. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to AFK for an hour. Whatever the fruit I find first is, then I will start grinding on the port island with that brand new fruit. So if you guys are excited, press like, subscribe to the channel. If you're new, it's only like 30% of you are subscribed. Hit that subscribe button 872 meters away. Let's just hope that it is like right here on the castle in the sea. And let's hope it's something good so we can get started like on a strong note because these videos can take a very long time if I get nothing but bad fruits. Oh, I see it. I saw it on the ground. What fruit is it? Please, please be... Is that the ice fruit? Yes. Okay. Ice fruit surely will be a good way to start. And here it begins, eight pirate millionaires level 1500. Let's go, let's hopefully do this very easily. I haven't even finished my first quest and I have 100 mastery. This is amazing. Third C will actually be easy with new fruits. This is the last one and we'll hit 1525, I think. I'm fairly certain I'll get three levels. This is amazing. The sort of only problem right now is that usually you would skip this entire island because it's really slow, but it's fine. I'm just going to do it this way. Hopefully our next fruit will be good and we'll just be able to continue. This is a pretty good pace so far. Oh no, another fruit has spawned. I was AFK for the last little bit there, but I got a good amount of leveling done just with the ice fruit. Come on game, please. Oh, that doesn't look like a good fruit. What's that? I don't know what any of the fruits look like anymore. What are you? Oh, the spin fruit. 
All right, I was already race version two, so I just have to go and uh, I think I have to get a bunch of chests. All right, is that enough? Looks like it was. All right, two mil, and then yes, there we go. We have agility now. We're good to go. 1,551. We can move on to the boss. Spin fruit is a uh, big yikes, but it is better than it used to be. Okay, finally a new fruit. I've just been killing the billionaires, waiting for another one to spawn. I got to 200 spin mastery. It wasn't too bad. Ooh, look at that. Oh, that's definitely... Oh, no, wait, that could be Quake. Yeah, that looks like Quake. Oh, I don't know if we've used Quake. I know it got a small rework. We have not used Quake at all. We've just hit 1,577, meaning that I can go to Hydra Island and start grinding. I was going to wait until I had Logia, but I have the Quake fruit now. So we might as well just go start fighting the Dragon Warriors. All right, I just hit 1,600. Thought I was recording, but I wasn't. My bad. But I'm going to stick to these guys. The Dragon Archers are kind of a pain to fight. And if I get lucky, I'll get a Logia fruit next. And I'll be able to get Logia on these guys, making life way easier. It is fruit time. Let's pray it is something good. Okay, looks like it's on the new island. Please don't kill me anything. Just let me get through here. Oh, did I go past it? Where is it? Hello? Good fruit, flea? Oh, it's in the walls here, is it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh! Oh, no. No! I mean, I haven't used the new spike fruit. It might be all right now. Oh, we're like just off 1,625. All right, once I get this level, we'll be able to move on to the females at the top of the island. 1,651, which means I have unlocked the giant islanders. Those female islanders would have been awesome if I just had a better fruit. The spike isn't bad but it is very slow. Finally, a devil fruit has spawned. This is my chance. All right, bit of a boat ride, but we're here on turtle. And we're definitely gonna find this in time. So please be like the light fruit or something. Oh, this tree. Oh, what's, wait, is that magma? Oh, gravity. Yo. Okay, I don't know if I used gravity before, but Gravity got revamped. This is exciting. All right, I can do the Empress in between kills now. I guess I'll fight her and then go back to Giant Islanders or whatever afterwards. I think the Gravity Fruit might actually be kind of good for this because I can safe spot her and like take minimal damage. This is it. I'm going to finally get off this island. I have not touched this account in a couple of weeks. Obviously, all the new stuff has been amazing in the latest update. But now we can, wait, we can finally go to Great Tree, which is this way. There is finally a fruit. That felt like a really long hour. I've got the Enforcer now because I needed to go fast in a different video. You know, gravity really isn't that bad anymore, but it's not amazing for like grouping up NPCs. All right, looks like we're around here somewhere. Please just be a good fruit. Please be a good fruit. What is it? Oh! Oh, that's so... Oh, oh, no way. That's amazing. That's so good for us. Soul is so fun to grind. It's going to take a while, but it's going to be worth it. Okay, I need to be stronger, like significantly stronger. And I'm kind of sick of feeling weak. So there is something that I can do to get an almost immediate upgrade. Because I'm Mink version 3, I can get Electro Claw pretty easily. All I need is 5,000 fragments. I have zero. Now, I don't think I'll be able to solo a raid, but that is what we're going to try while I've got a decent fruit. Even though my soul isn't 250 mastery yet, I got a decent fruit. I'm going to try and solo a raid. But if that doesn't work, I can always fight elite NPCs and sea beasts until I have 5,000 fragments. Six and a half hours later. Okay, boss is dead. I actually did it! I got 600 frap. That's not bad. Okay, I can grind that out a little bit over the next couple of hours, and we will be able to get an electric floor. All right, since I have a really good fruit right now for fighting bosses, and the Keeler Admiral is just up here, I'm gonna server hop, fight the boss. Hopefully, it'll get me some mastery as well. But this means I probably won't run into a new fruit for a little bit. I'm gonna do this maybe until level 1800. All right, this will be our last of the Kilo Admiral. This has been really good. This fruit's great for grinding bosses, so I knew I could do this. And that's the level. Some random Buddha guy showed up and helped me out. 
All right, I believe this is where I'm starting up now. Yes, 1775, we're doing the Fishman Raiders. And also, I'm fairly certain I'm getting really close to enough fragments to upgrade to Electro Claw, which will be so good. All right, last Raider, and then we can move on to, I think it's just those guys over there. And there we go, new quest is available. I don't know how long I do these guys for, but they're a little bit more annoying than the Raiders to fight. Fishman Captain. Forest Pirates, 25 levels on these guys. And then I think we go up behind here, which I never did on my main account. All right, big sad. Our time has come. A fruit has spawned. Okay, I would love a grinding fruit. Something like the light fruit. Oh, there it is. What's that? Oh, that could be barrier. I haven't used new barrier. That kind of looked like... Yeah, that's barrier. Okay. Alrighty, guys. So I ended up mostly server hopping sea beasts. I did, I think three dark raids and then mostly sea beasts and the boats but i have just over enough fragments to do this guy's challenge now so if you can get to the mansion within 30 seconds i'll consider telling you you have 30 seconds all right let's go 15 seconds i didn't go over the wall like a smart person there we go all right let's go get our electric claw all right three mil five thousand easy done and this kind of works out perfect for us as well because there's a little trick i can do with the barrier fruit so once we got the quest, we can push this guy with the barrier wall. And that kind of didn't work because he bounced. But if he goes behind the wall, he can't hurt me, but I can hurt him. There we go, 1851. This is a little bit annoying now. The quest guy is here, but I'm pretty certain the mythical pirates are like up over here somewhere. Easy fruit spawn, please be good. Barrier has been a little bit painful. That's flat. Yes! Okay, I think I, have I used flame? I don't know, but it's going to be better than barrier. Our fruit has spawned. So grinding this guy, the boss, and grinding the mythical pirates was terrible. So I've just been doing the forest pirates and finally it is time to get a new fruit. I'm one level away from finishing where I was up to as well. All right, well, I have to admit new flame fruit, very awesome. Really good to grind with. Come on, lucky new fruit. Where is he? Over here? Oh, <laughs> I just helped somebody in another video that I'm doing get rid of the falcon fruit. That is unfortunate. All right, I knocked out 1,900 to 1,925 down here in the jungle pirates. And I'm about to hit 1,950 here against these guys. Oh, I just died and a fruit just spawned in the same clip. Amazing. Okay, let's get out of here. Based on, wait, based on those numbers, am I near the fruit? Is it on this island? Come on, something good. Something like the light fruit. The light fruit, please. Oh, is that, that's the spike. No. Finally, on to our last two. The spike fruit hasn't been too bad. It's better than the falcon. And after this, we can move on to the haunted castle in the sea, which will be different. I'm fairly certain everything over there is pretty easy to grind. All right, spawn set. Exciting. We've only got a couple more islands to go. Reborn skeletons are up first. Yeah, these guys are easy. A fruit, finally. Honestly, this is... <laughs> I really don't want the spike fruit anymore. Blocks fruit gods, please shine on my humble character today. Are you kidding? Oh, no, wait. That's the poor fruit. Okay, I thought it was the spike fruit. I don't think I've ever used the poor fruit. I hit level 2000 without realizing, which is good and bad. I kind of hate fighting the living zombies over here. Living zombie doesn't make sense. All right, last two of these guys. And then I think we just move into the entryway of the castle. So demonic souls, 2025. I think I'm doing these guys and I won't do the possessed mummies downstairs, but we'll see. It does not feel like I've had the poor fruit for an hour, but I guess a fruit has spawned. All right, game. Give me the good stuff. Oh, is that string? Nice. If I have string mastery, this could be awesome. Even if I don't, I'll get string mastery, I guess. I already have some. Yes. All right. We have finally finished the haunted island. I just did the demonics the whole time. The guys in the basement have like the dark fruit. They're a pain. All right, a fruit. Please be something a little bit better than string for farming. Oh, it must be like just down. Right, right. Oh, there it is. Is that? Oh, that could be flame. Flame would kind of be perfect. Yes. 
I'll take that. It's better than string. All right, final two of the peanut presidents. Then we're moving on, assuming I don't die here. And there we go. Easy game. I think that means this island. Yeah, this island, then this island, then chocolate island. Oh man, last one of these. And I'm so glad to have these guys done. They're a bit annoying. Anyone who kicks is annoying to grind against. I actually have a feeling that the next NPCs are even more annoying. All right, 2,150, which means we can do the ice cream commanders. Oh no, new fruit time? This could change things. I've kind of been doing really good with, like I'm in a groove with the flame fruit. You know how you get a combo going? Yeah, I got a combo right now. And I'd really rather that not be ruined. All right, game. C give me soul again. Soul was so good to grind with. Wait, where is he? Hello? I don't know where. Oh, it's up here. It's up here. Okay. No, it's not up here. Oh, it's, by it's in the wall. There, the... Oh, no. <laughs> All right, level 2200. And it looks like we are going to... That's the first time I've ever used the compass. It looks like we are going over here. So cookie crafters for the next 25 levels. I fairly certain I'll do these and then I will do these guys as well. All right, last one of these guys and then I might move on. These are really easy to group up so they're kind of efficient to fight against. These guys also, oh, they have three sword style. Yeah, and I think I'm gonna stick over here at least until I get a better fruit. All right, lucky us, there is a new fruit. Oh, wait, is that shadow? No, it's bomb. I have not used bomb fruit since the latest update. Maybe it's all right now. Finally, 2,250. I'm fairly certain at least these yellow guys, they call baking stuff. These guys are good to grind. I don't know if I'll do these guys afterwards though. We're like one kill away from 2,275. These guys are pretty good to grind. I might stick to them. I'm gonna try the others out. These ones you can group up really easily. I didn't level up. I'm one level away from changing islands, but the fruit comes first. Bomb really hasn't been that bad to grind with, honestly. All right, get, what's that? Oh, is that chop? It is chop, no. I, I, well, I don't know if chop's good or bad anymore, but I can't imagine it's that good. Okay, chop fruit, definitely not fun, but we are 1,300. We're going on a chocolate island. We've got 99 levels to go. And then we finished the game with the Devil Fruit Notifier Game Pass. This was really fun. I would definitely maybe do this again one day if this video gets enough likes. Oh, the last three of these are nearly complete. I did these Coco Warriors all the way to 2,350 purely because for some reason, these guys don't have any special ability, which is really weird. The fruit is only 200, or well, it's less than 200. It was 202 meters away. Oh, I know where it is. It's right here. Oh, oh, no. Oh, no. Even worse. I mean, it's still better than the chop fruit, I think. Oh, the last three, and then we are on to the last NPCs before we complete the game. It's not cool to end with Falcon, kind of meh, but chances are I'll just get a bad fruit anyway if another one spawns. And that's the level. This is it, boys. I'm honestly, it's a little bit sad. This account has been really, really fun to play, but all good things must end. And we're going to hit max level, maybe after a couple of updates, maybe the fourth C or something, when max level goes up to like 3,000 or something. Then we could bring this back and, and level it up again. Here we go. Boom. 2,400. You don't even get a pink message when you hit max. That's kind of lame. Let's go ahead and pop that in there. Thank you all for watching. If you guys enjoyed, leave a like. Comment down below for any other series you'd like me to do like this, and I'll see you all next time.